Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Selling with Corey, where we sit down, do these chit chat videos with my print on demand stores, follow me on my journey. And today I wanted to do a super quick video about my March on demand store, uh, including my husband's March on demand store, because I don't know if I've mentioned it before, but he has one as well that I tend to manage and keep track of to help him out with. And as you all know from last week's video, I have started swapping out all of my designs for fall designs. And now between both of our accounts, I'm working on Halloween designs as well, since that's pretty much what I wanted to start doing in September anyway. So I currently have a shirt that has been under review for about two or three days now. I'm still kind of waiting to see what they're flagging it with or having them double check it. It is a Hocus Pocus design shirt. Um, so we'll kind of have to wait and see what happens with that. Obviously, Merch by Amazon has a lot of restrictions when it comes to things. So I'll have to see if it passes or not. If it doesn't, then I'll just have to keep that design on my Etsy shop only. Um, if it does, then that'll be great because obviously I do think anything that deals with Halloween and Hocus Pocus has a really good sell rate from what I can see at least. But worst case scenario, they decline it and I can't use it, not a big deal. Now, all of my designs have officially been swapped out on mine since obviously I started swapping out my designs first. And I'm almost halfway through my husband's design and I go on today to delete a design and go ahead and put another Halloween one up to find out that he sold one. So I'm super stoked about that. I was looking at his account and I saw that he sold a shirt and I was like, we sold one not from a family member not to a friend just you know some random whoever purchased it off of amazon.com we sold a shirt so that makes me super excited obviously i have my shirts priced at $13.99 which is what i have been told to do them at until they start selling now i have to go back and rewatch the video that i was following all of this on because i'm pretty sure it says once you sell one shirt, you should up that price by a dollar. So I'm gonna have to go back and kind of make sure because I can't remember if it's once you sell a shirt or if it's once you get a review. So we'll have to kind of wait and see what happens. Uh, the shirt that he sold was a fall design shirt. So I'm super stoked about that. Obviously with it being September, more people are going to start looking at fall and are going to start looking into buying more fall designs, especially those that like to wait until it gets closer to October. So I'm super stoked and I'm really hoping that this is just a sign that more things will start to kind of get out there and will start to get purchased. So I'm super happy about that. Uh, obviously because we have it sold at $13.99, our royalty fee on it is only 70 cents. But that's not bad at some point obviously they're going to start paying for themselves and that'll mostly pay for what i paid for that design at least half if not more of what i paid for that design is what that royalty will pay for so i'm going to start basically reaccumulating some of the money that i have put into these designs at that point so if you want maybe at my six month mark with my print on demand services i'll sit down and I'll break down all of the money wise versus what I've paid going into everything and how much we have made out with going into everything. And I can keep it to just my March by Amazon or I can obviously do both. If you wanna see both at that point, I will leave that up to you. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. So like I said, this is just gonna be a super short video um, because I was just really excited. The fact that we sold a design that wasn't to somebody we know. So that's super exciting in my book. I'm super happy about that. Uh, if you enjoyed this, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you can see all of my print on demand journeys and the random videos I tend to do in between. I hope you enjoyed this. I'll see you all next time. Bye.